Hello friends and welcome back to another episode of our NC500 journey. Today we'll be touring John O'Groats and we will also be visiting Duncaspi. So currently right now we are walking up to the famously known as John O'Groats signpost which is at near the northerly point of uh, mainland Britain. And John O'Groats is um, the most uh, northerly village in the whole mainland Britain. And currently right now we're walking up to the signpost. You can see there are the Nombadink boulders which are uh, artifacts right next to the John O'Groats signpost. And you can you maybe can see uh, the islands right after mainland Britain. You can also see the luxury apartments right uh, near the John O'Groats signpost. Guys, now we're at the signpost John O'Groats. So currently right now we're at the harbour where they keep the ferries that they take uh, to the Colonial Islands. These ferries are accessed by John O'Groats and uh, are taken to the Colonial Islands. So John O'Groats is a village in Scotland only not 2.5 miles northeast of Canspe Cathinus in the far north of Scotland. John O'Groats lies on Great Britain's northern tip and is popular with tourists as one of the ends. Uh, it is the most northerly village in the whole mainland Scotland and mainland Britain. Now we'll start begin touring uh, Duncaspi Head. Duncaspi Head is only about two miles northeast of John O'Groats. When you arrive at the village, there is a sign showing um, two miles to Duncaspi Head. And it's just a straight path with amazing views while going to the car park. There's a path to go up to the stacks, the stone stacks in the sea. And on the path, there are loads and loads of um, sheep, which is really, really cool. Then there are amazing views, as you can see here. Uh, and then on the way when we were walking we saw a, a loads of loads of sheep just going past our past which at Duncaspi Head there is a lighthouse um, and this this lighthouse was established in 1924 the reason a lighthouse was built here was because um, during the World War II there are loads and loads amount of shipwrecks around that point Now um, we are at the stone stacks. Uh, you can see two, but you can't see the top because it was quite foggy. And so the Duncaspi Head is the most northerly part of both Scottish and British mainlands, slightly north northeast of John O'Groats. It lies approximately 20 kilometres southeast of Dunnet Head, the northmost point of both Scottish and British mainlands. Also on the way down we saw some cows and we just stopped by to take a video of them and they all just started staring at me. So guys I hope you enjoyed John O'Groat and Duncaspi Head and, and I will see you guys in the next NC500 episode.